Hi all, I wanted to talk with you about why should I never live alone as a Christian? Basically, you know, when it comes to comes to that, although 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 things might seem tempting, you know, living on your own and doing your own thing without any bo- without anyone bothering you. The thing with that is that you know whenever you struggle with anything as a Christian as a Christian you know you when you struggle with anything you don't have no one to to lift you up you know you could go somewhere like I suppose if, if you have a next door neighbor it will it will be okay but no it's not all the time your next door neighbor will be free to talk they could be busy doing other things you know and you could and you have no one to refer back to or to or to encourage you in times of trials and temptations and you're more likely to 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 yield to that temptation or temptations because like the Bible says in the Old Testament it says in the Bible it's not good for a man or woman to be alone and and you can write that in the search engine it's not good for a man to be alone Bible and you should be to find that because I'm not making these things up so you know also I'm I'm sure it can be depressing I've experienced being alone before and it is depressing it's not a nice feeling some people are good at some people are good at it but I'm not but it, some people some some people are good at it if they if they're not a Christian yeah but eventually they'll they'll probably be un- unhappy but it, it's always good to be be with somebody you know just for for companionship if anything I don't think I mean that by a partner so yeah companionship is basic you know yeah, I didn't didn't even know that this word existed actually. Companionship. It's spelled companionship. C O M P A N I O N S H I P, which may which basically means feeling of feeling of fellowship or friendship. So yeah, just try and find someone to socialize with or your or or. or Maybe not really find find somebody, but just have somebody in in the place where you're living, not not completely on your own. Basically, if you if you got a spare room in your home or flat, just try and invite someone to live with you. Although you might you might you might have to get used to their habits, you know. Event eventually, I'm sure you'll get used to it. You know, it's on, it's only you know. We're Christians, so Christians don't always argue, as you guys, ladies, well know, well, well know. So yeah, so yeah, like that's really all I have to say in this video. So God bless. Take care and peace be with you. If you're in a talk, give me a call. Bye for now. In the description.